Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Nino Kuni, where this episode we are inside Drippy's mom's belly and we're here to save the littlies and it's telling us to go into this area here. Classroom. Oh hello, what are you, sir? Kira. Nasty, nasty, beastie, beastie. Uh Mr. Drippy, look! Oh Nickas, if we don't do something quick, the Rada going to make himself a little, a little of the omelet. We have to save him. So somehow Beast got inside Drippy's mom. Stay calm now. How did that happen? Didn't they say she can't keep her mouth long enough to, for anything to go inside unless she's laughing? Well, mm -hmm. these guys aren't too much more time, so good to see that, though. A lot of our new creatures are getting action. I want to try this out. All out of time. There it goes. Batman laughing it up. Leo leveling up as well. Leo, Simba. Are you okay? Ta 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 very much. Oh, he's so sweet. Oi, Lily, what happened by here anyway? Nasty, nasty, proper nasty. What's that? No, never. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. That's terrible. The fairy castle has been invaded. Horrible beasties have turned up. And they've been bullying all the littlies, the rotas. That's awful. We have to help. Please, man. Please, man. Please, please, please. Of course we'll help them. Because without saying in it, I'm just wondering how come beasties got in here in the first place. Could he have made it all the way to the fairy ground? Shadar. It's possible, I suppose. Yeah, but if he's made it past Ma. Judging by what we saw, saw him during the storm, I don't think getting past your mom would be much of a challenge. It doesn't matter how they got in. What matters right now is saving the littlies. You're right, Esther. Oi, stay by here. Where it's safe, right? Nah, man. Wait, man. Nah. Wait, wait, wait. Didn't you hear him? Stay here, he said. But look at him. We can't just leave him here. He's terrified. We have to take him with us. Oh, we're off bashing beasties, ain't it? It's not safe, man. It's, it's safe by here. Scary, scary, proper scary. Ah. Uh, don't be scared. You'll be fine. I guess it's kind of dangerous to leave him here too, huh? Mr. Drippy? Drippy Heckman, all right. Come on then, you. We'll look after you. Yes, come along now, literally. Tidy, let's go. Tidy, tidy. Go, go, go. Ch literally is now following you. Cool. Tidy, looks like the door in the rose room come unlocked. In the rose room... It's pretty far, actually. One at a time. And you, sir, a splish your splosh. Splah! Oh no, another one! Quick, Ollie boy! We've got to save those literally. Airheads and Splisher A and Splisher B. That should be easy. Not much of a problem. I'll go for the airhead. I always go for the airhead for whatever reason. And Leo's out there. Good to see Leo out there fighting. I would recommend to give him some more time to level up. Esther. You know, I was watching videos about Yokai Watch. And Yokai Watch is made by level 5, which helped me. You know, Kumi? So, I mean. I don't know. I'm, I want to see how that works out. Okay. I'm kind of looking forward to it, especially since there's no Pokemon game coming out. This year, I mean, I'm not one of those people who wants to be rushed out or anything like that. But, but um, yeah, I'm, I, I want to see how this, how this game looks. Seems interesting. Looks like you play a minigame to attack. 
It's got some interesting levels. It, it does kind of remind me of... Oh, cool, we got a sun drop. <gasps> Maybe we can get a star drop. Oh, please let me get a star drop. I need a star drop. I need to get my hands on a star drop so I can metamorphose little Jazz and maybe he can get some good attacks. Ah! And then we gotta level up uh, Swain's Gunther, whatever guy, dude. He was actually doing pretty good there. Got some nice stats on him right there. We got some more littlies. Now let's go. Teddy, looks like the door in the tilly room's come unlocked. Tulips. This way. I remember seeing the tulip over here. There he goes. So yeah, I'm kind of excited. Uh, hooray, right? If I'm not mistaken. Hurrah! Okay, hurrah. Hooray, hurrah. Hooray. We hooray, A, B, N, C. D, E, F, Y, and G. I don't know. I, I don't even... Did I, I didn't even say that right, did I? Wow, that was horrible. Well, we are in a kindergarten classroom. I'm just learning my uh, alphabet then. Oh wow, he hit me hard. I want to try this all-out attack thing. Okay, let's get down. Uh, uh, there we go. Good job there. Nice teamwork. We did it. Moon drop. Oh, come on, star drops. Give me the star drop. Let's heal Esther up a little bit before we move on. Don't want her going down again. Tidy. Looks like the door in the da daffodil rooms come unlocked. Daffodil, huh? Now I'm looking at the map and I'm wondering about this room because it seems to have like another exit. Oh, well, that's a waste. I could have just come and restored everything without wasting my MP. No, I don't want to say the problem. What's this? Let me use a sec, Ollie boy. There's something I've got to tell you. What's that, Mr. Drippy? Those steps by there are emergency exits out of Ma's guts. We call them the back passage, see? Oh. Oh. Back passage. I see. The back passage? That's right, man. So if you ever need to get out of Ma, guts in a hurry, just nip up those stairs. Uh, sure, but what's to stop the Little E's doing the same? Don't be daft, man. They ain't baby steps, are they? Way too high for the Little E's, they are. Now, the back passage will take you straight to the fairgrounds, so you can come and go as you please, ain't it? Uh, so we could have used them to get in here in the first place? Well, yeah, I suppose. But where's the fun in that, man? Always been one for a grand entrance, me. Got my reputation to think of, ain't it? Jeez. Huh. And I wonder why these guys haven't reported anything about the Little Leaves if they're in here just, uh... You're on your break. Chippy Mon, what are you doing by here? Saving the Little Leaves that you guys are, like, obviously ignoring? You guys are the guardians of this place. You guys are horrible at your job. What? I thought I, I, thought I went in. Ooh, one of those uh, plusies, plusy, plus I. I remember fighting these in the when I was grinding. I remember I ran into these a lot. And they got on my nerves. But payback is gonna be good and sweet. Oh yeah, we're definitely doing better. Oh yeah. What's that battle with Star. Leo got some help. Taking these guys is no problem. Take out the Sparker. Sparky. But yeah, Yokai Watch. Like I said, anyone in, anyone excited for Yokai Watch? I mean, I am. Uh, not excited to say like like I'm like I'm gonna pre-order this and get it day one and stuff like that. I'm gonna actually wait a little bit. See, Tidy looks like the door in the Violet Room come unlocked. See if. Uh, See how the reviews sound and then how the people react to the game, you know? And then I'll pick it up. I always like a good RPG anyway to begin with. Oh, you're a big one. I want you. I want to capture you. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Upper no bubbler. Slacking, you lot. 
Hubber? Blubber. I want one of those. Those are cool. I'm gonna go straight for you. I'm gonna go for the biggest one. Okay. Keep this up, huh? Come on. You don't scare me. Get back here. Stop ignoring me and fight me. Okay, never mind. Ignore me a little bit. Then fight me. Oh, Esther's down. Oh, that's not good. Ah, I almost got him. I'm gonna get one of these things right here. Oh, wait, he's not down. Okay, he is down. It takes me a while to pass out because he's so big. Let's get a little Jazz out here and give us some love. Come on, little Jazz. Oh, and you're actually doing some good damage. Oh, but you take big damage. Hey, Undertaker, you want to help out anytime soon? Just saying. Oh, I got some weird names for my familiars. Oh, boy. That's not good. Yeah, I said that was going to take, take a big one there. Down he goes. <laughs> Is that it? No drop good stuff. Ah. Seems like some good levels up all across the board. All here, all here. Tidy, tidy, tidy. That's some proper good work, you lot. Looks like all the littlies are safe and sound. Are you sure? Thank goodness for that. Let's have a quick count up. One, two, three, four, five. All the lilies are alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Never let them go again. There's eleven. There's a dozen. Hey, that's Beaven. He's my cousin. How do man? Why the gang's all here, Tidy? Well, technically, they're coming out of your mom. Blimey, rimey, Tidy, Tidy, Drippy, Drippy. Gah, don't they ever shut up? They're so annoying. How do you get rid of them? We take them to the exit, ain't it? There's a slide outside. You go down, and the way out is just by the bottom there. A slide? Why is there a slide? It's to remind them that they can't slip and slide on the banana skins of life in here. But when they go outside, the same stuff won't slide, ain't it? Typical Ma. That is, she's a big fan of the old tough love. I have literally no idea what you're talking about. Are you fairies all completely mad? <laughs> I don't care what he means, I'm just looking forward to, sl to the slide. Ah, to be young and simple and flexible. That sounds like it's going to hurt. Not long now until the littlies are finally born. Let's take them to the exit. I mean, so your mom is the mom of all the... I'm going to go back and actually like, like restore myself. Your mom is the mom of all the fairies. So technically, all the fairies are brothers and sisters. So how is he your cousin if he's, if he's related to your mother? If he's your mother... Oh, no, I don't want to save my progress. Yes, cancel. I just wanted to restore my stuff. Makes no sense. Oh, wow, I just ran drippy over. But anyway, he's your cousin. We'll go with that. That's the official story. And down we go. Now all we've got to do is hop on the slide. And we'll be out of Ma's guts before you know it. You ready to go, Ollie boy? Let's take the slide. I wonder why he asked me that. Right, oh! Come on, Littlies! It's time for the slidey ride of your tiny, tiny lives! <laughs> well, don't just stand there, come on! Huh? <laughs> what the? What is that thing? Royal jelly, Bane of Mom's belly. That rotter of a squid's got our kids. What the heck? The Littlies! No way! We already saved them once. Sorry, Ollie boy, but the future of the fairy race is at stake. Ah, do we have any choice? And we're tossed into a battle. With the royal jelly, how did he get inside? I'm wondering how all these creatures get inside. Do they just walk in through the back door? Or something like that? Oh, let's go. Let's do this. Okay, defend that. Okay, stopped it. Come on, guys. Let's do it. Get in there. 
trap, man. Be careful. There we go, guys. Come on, we're doing good damage here. See stars defend. Okay, he doesn't do anything big with that. All out attack. Come on, we can do this. Come on. Alright, we just step away from this one and uh, bring little jazz into the mix. Whoa! Bad timing for little jazz. Oliver's fine. Okay, Esther just healed me. He's coming for me, too. Um, some Tonko out here, but I don't think her water bomb is really going to do anything against a water creature. Yeah, resistance to that. Uh, did I defend in time? I hope I did. Yes, I did, and I hit, and I hit defend all. Okay, they're still defending though. Would really like it if you guys attack. Okay, there's a time limit to how long it lasts. Okay, so it should be out now. And I recovered a little bit of health while I was there, and now we're taking some shots. And Swain stole some stuff from there. Ah, but get a little jazz back. Come on, jazz. I really need to level up little Jazz. I feel like he's gonna have some incredible potential. Good job, little Jazz. Baby shower. I feel like he's gonna have incredible potential ones. Whoa! What the fuck the heck? There's loads of little things coming out of it, man. Mind you, it looks proper knackered after popping that that lot out. Now's your chance to give it a smack or two, Ollie boy. Oh boy. Ah. Uh, All out attack, guys. Come on. Yep. Come on, just go for these guys. Oh, these little people. Ooh, 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 ooh. Slash dance, come on. I hope I don't lose the other one. That would be amazing if I could make it to him. Perfect. Please tell me they're still there. Let's see what little jazz does. No! Will win. Nice job there. All right, little jazz. Time flies. What does that do? I'm kind of disappointed in that one. Come on, can we make it? 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 Ah! Uh, yeah, I made it, but I'm gonna get, I'm gonna lose it because I'm getting attacked. Or did I? No, I still have it. I still have it. Let's do it. Slash dance. I'm not sure exactly what Little Jazz did. I think it's a perk off, but, but I don't really know which one. Yeah, like I said, I think Little Jazz once he levels up or gets to metamorphosis. He'll learn some attacking moves because he doesn't really have an attack move. He just kind of see stars move out the way. He got Batman. Yeah, he doesn't have an attacking move, which kind of makes him useless at the moment. Oh, he's attacking Bane. He's attacking uh, Swain now. I said Bane. But yeah. Uh, Little Jazz doesn't really have an attacking or any like them. He's not a good physical attacker, as you can tell. He's, I think he's better than Chunky. But uh, he doesn't have any big magic attacks, and that's his like forte is magic attacks. Come on, Little Jazz, get out there. We can do this together. Oh, he took a hit, but it's okay. Let's do this. Come on, let's end it. I believe in you, buddy. That's why I have you out here. Time to shine. Oh boy, okay. that's the time to shine. Uh, I want to get smacked because I think he's even straight for me too. Yeah, that's a thought. No. Oh, don't attack. Don't attack anybody. 
Get away. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Ah. There you go. There you go, Paul. Get away from me. There we go, much better. Okay. Stay away, stay away. He doesn't take her or something. I don't mind him. He doesn't do much physical damage anyway. He's really good at defense. Come on, little Jazz. Let me let you finish this one off. Get out there. Okay, someone else did it, but hey, we were in there. A little Jazz some love. We won! Whew. Oh, that was a hard battle. Thanks to all the level ups and all the good equipment that we bought. Spirit of the Storm. Oliver reached level 27. Paul reached level 26. Jazz reached level 26 as well. See, that's what I mean. His magic attack is incredibly high. Probably one of the highest. It's higher than Tanku's even. Tanku reached level 27. Leo reached level 12. Simba reached level 13. Simba learned Smoke Bomb. Undertaker reached level 15. I just need that star drop, man. Those are hard to find. I wonder if that's everywhere, just like in just I'm um, having horrible luck. You tend to page describing the royal jelly. Ta man, ta ta, ta 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 ta. Thank goodness, is everyone all right? Ah, of course they are. Littlies, these littlies are nowhere near as fragile as their egg looking. When I was their age, I ate squid for breakfast. Proper hard it was. But wasn't that a jellyfish just now? What a lucky escape, though. I've never seen a sea creature so big. I thought we were finished. Well, something had to be done about it. And I suppose we were just the ones to do it, eh? This heroic of us. Sure, someone had to make sure the little these made it out somehow, huh? Speaking of which, how do we get out of here? Yes, how do we get out of here? That there's no way out. We can't get back up the slide. Of course we can't. It's a mile back up to the top. So what do we do? What do you think we do, man? We get reborn, ain't it? Huh? What? Yeah, we pop out along with the littlies. Come on, man. You only live once. And you're only supposed to be born once, too. You demented little gnome. Just what are you suggesting? You flipping humans are so prudish. It's like this, see? Just up beyond there is mom's exit. It's where the little the lilies get born from it, from it, ain't it? And if we just pop out with them, we'll be back in the fairground before you know it. Besides, it's like we've got much choice in the matter. Just pop out. Are you mad? Poppy, toppy, tidy, righty, way. Gee, I don't know about this. Don't worry. As long as we're all together, we'll make it through somehow. Remember the island storm? We survived that, didn't we? Toppy, poppy, toppy, poppy. And I guess this is it. Time to be born again. Here goes nothing, man. We'll make a quick exit. And one heck of an entrance. Oh, they're coming. Oh, I can feel it! Oh, they're coming! At long last! Come on, my little darlings! time where's drippy it's getting late yeah he must be knackered after the day we've had I know I am oh look there he is you boys did a proper tidy jump on mom was laughing fit to flipping burst 
Well, we couldn't have done it without you, drippy boy. And pizza the lot really pack, really punch, ain't it? Though, we were on fire, man. Yeah, I suppose you would have bombed without my help, eh? Mind you, your routine. I've got to say, man, it was pretty flipping funny. Really, thanks, drippy boy. Took me back a day, back to the days when the stage was still my life, hey? It's tidy while ago now. Your gags are legendary, man. Classic they were. Our material, nothing compared to yours. I'm just chuffed we made you chuckle. He's right, man. When it comes to tickling mom's funny bone, there's no one ever did it quite like you, drippy boy. So I wonder why, why he didn't make him laugh in the first place. Stop it, man. You're making me blush. The time for my jokes is long gone. I won't be back on the circuits anytime soon. Besides, I got... I got that look lot to be shepherding around now, ain't it? What would they do without me? Trippy boy. But I don't think about it sometimes. What what would happen, you know? If I never gone off with Alicia like? I wonder how far I would have gone in the old comedy game. Mr. Trippy. Oh, Shula, it is. What's up? You didn't hear all that, did ya? Uh, we, um, no, we didn't hear anything. No, no, we just got here, didn't we? Um, anyway, it's late. We should go some, we should get some rest. Yeah, you're right, tidy. I'll show you the old inn, shall we? Shall I? It's a bit small for you lot. We'll just have to grim a bit and bear it. How am I supposed to sleep in a face size bed? I'm sure you'll manage somehow. Never seen too much trouble falling into a deep and noisy sleep. Gee, poor Mr. Drippy. <laughs> oh, Oliver, what's wrong? It's Philip. He's mean. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, Yolly boy. Don't cry, man. I'm the tear fairy, see? I don't like seeing them go to waste. You're a... a fairy? I am, and a proper tidy one at that. You talk funny. <laughs> That's how fairies talk, sweetie. But it's goofy. Oh, is it now? Well, I wish I'd known that before I made him for you. Nobody made him. He's my friend. Of course he is. I'm sorry. And I'm sure he'll always be your friend, no matter what. Come on now, don't be such a crybaby bunting. What would Mr. Drippy think? I'm not a crybaby bunting. Then you'd better dry those tears, hadn't you? Hmm? Interesting. Ah, oh, how can I ever thank you, Batch? Saved my life, you did. We're just happy to help, ma'am, and we're sure glad the little lilies are safe. But are you all right now? You did have a giant jellyfish inside you, after all. Ah, oh, is that what it was? I thought it was a squid. That's why I love a bit of seafood, see? And it looks so big and juicy, I just couldn't help myself. You mean... That's right. Batch swallowed it straight down, I did. What? There we were, worrying she'd been attacked by Shadar. It was all because she's too greedy for her own good. Look on the bright side, Swain. It means the reason was much less serious than we thought it was. Shadar, you say? Where have I heard that name before? Shadar. Shadar. Oh, him. You know Shadar, ma'am? Nope. <laughs> is she... Is she taking the mick? Sorry. Love, of course I know him. He's the one who has flying around my head, causing all kinds of mischief. Proper little terror he is. Smiley, surly. Get your bottoms over by here. We're here, we're here. Keep your hair on, man. What is it, Ma? Stop flipping, shouting. Can you two boys go and take over by Shadar Castle for me? Wh Niggas! Not bad, love, not bad. I thought you lost your comic touch. But what a reaction. Found you, found your form again. You have. There's lovely. The same part about flipping Atmon. He just asked us to go to flipping Shadar's castle. 
What kind of reaction did you expect? We can't refuse Mom. No, can we? Ah, uh, you'd best go and have a look, eh? Crikey, you don't take much convincing, do you? Yeah, man, but thinking about it, only boy and that. They helped us out good and proper, ain't it, though? At least we can do is return the favor. There you go being noble again. What did I tell you about that? Please, boys, for me. You wouldn't have to disappoint your dear old mom, now would you? You can say that again. We know better than to get on your bad side. Looks like we're taking a subtactical. Then. What's that splitting up? You mean? I too. Might as well, eh? How many times have we're not flipping splitting up, I meant? We'll have to take a break for a bit, honestly. Thank you, Smiley. Thank you, Shirley. Don't think us, man. It was her flipping idea. Ta, mom. Anyway, we'll let Drippy Boy know if we find anything in, in it. Thank you. Speak. He slipped off in it. Probably, Probably gone to say bye to all the boys in town. town eh? Mr. Drippy? Right so, you're off now, ain't you, Batch? Me? Ah, uh, yes, mom. Oh, it's all over. We have to find the next great sage. Of course you do, love. Your wizard, ain't it? Fancy a spell or two to be going on your way with. Uh, oh, yeah, I guess. I mean, yes, please, ma'am. We received shift shape. Second self. Ooh, I like that. What sound of that one? Mimic. Vanish. Ah, I like that one too. We're a cat. Oh, that's interesting. We're a fish. Shrink. Open mind. Well, she has more spells than the than the kings did. Loaf of life. Wow, that's a keep on going, huh? Poison apple. Wow, that's a lot of spells. Huh, it sure is. Thank you so much, ma'am. And they're all proper useful ones, too. Well, useful to the fairies, at least. Still, I'm sure there's one or two in there that you can make us l use of, love. We'll have a look later. We need to get moving. Come on. We've wasted enough time. Let's find Lantern Face and get back to the boat. You're right. We need to get back on the trail for the Great Sage. We sure do. Goodbye, ma'am. Goodbye. Tara, my loves. Pop by any time. Drippy left you. So guys, we have to go find Drippy this uh, coming next episode. So remember guys, if you guys like the episode, consider buying the game. It was a different experience when that plays it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And come back tomorrow for a brand new episode of Nino Kuni. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.